And welcome back folks, welcome back to Let's Play Take No Prisoners. Last episode we got a new weapon. Yes. The M12 Assault. The M12 Assault Rifle. Semi-automatic 12mm assault rifle with in internal recoil suppressor and barrel mounted projectile accelerator. Yeah. And we got... We actually found a supply of health. A med station. Because if you remember, the last time I was suffering through a whole episode with only 5.1% fuck. 5.1% fuck. Not fuck, health. Um, and do excuse me when I will just take the freedom to reload. Just because this game is balls hard and I just made a mistake. This game is hard. Yeah. This game. Save this. This game does not care. There is a finite amount of health supply. So if you are not up to the up to the job, well then I guess bad luck for you. Because this game surely is not going to fuck around. Oh yeah. It's not going to hold your hand. But it does give you the tools to survive. Um, it is, a, in a way, it is a survival. Well, horror maybe. It's not quite a horror game, but it is a survival game. It is at least as much a horror game as oh yeah, a game like Left 4 Dead is. I do not appreciate being shot from behind. Not that I would appreciate getting shot anyway, but getting shot from behind is something I especially oh, yeah. do not appreciate. Yeah, and that's the point where the that innovative and unique um, perspective in this game really starts to suck. Suck ass. Cause you can't see enemies. Um, that your character would be able to see. Can I blow this up? By the way. No, it doesn't seem like. Can I destroy anything? It seems that the environment here is not destructible. Um, the fact that the your view is hindered by the perspective does add something. It does add a sense of uneasiness to the game. Yeah, I'm, I'm really scared to go to go forward. I think, in a way, this, um, this strange perspective works. Ah, there you are. Okay. Just not get caught in an ambush. Like so. Ah, oh yeah. Okay. Just wait. Wait for him to get me. He doesn't want to get me. Fair enough. Then do not. Then do not. I really want to get in there. Okay. Uh, is this door locked? It's locked. Okay. But there one was one of those grenade throwing guys. I... 
Okay. That did the trick. We have so much. I should start using my... My grenade launcher. I should be using that, actually. Even though I, usually I just kill myself when I try to use it. Every time I try to use it, I kill myself. But let's try something. Um, let's see if I can shoot through this fence. No, I can't. I almost shot myself. Okay, can I shoot over this wall? Yeah, I can actually. That's handy. For some reason this grenade seems to be completely ineffective against anything. Uh, can I open that door? Can I open it? No, can't. Nothing to use here. What the fuck? I speak English very good. I learned it in the school. When I was small, I learned the English. Okay. And that glass is still unbreakable. Uh, hmm. This is probably indestructible. Hmm. Mm -hmm -hmm. Okay, there's only one way to go here. Okay. At least two ways to go. And then got me a little sucker. Okay, maybe I don't understand. I don't quite understand the nature. That's better. Of that. A grenade launcher. Weapon. Hmm. Radiated grenades. Okay. So it's apparently not effective against things that are already immune to radiation. I suppose. So rats are immune to radiation then. And zombies. Also one strange thing that I noticed, I didn't mention, <laughs> that I think there's a zombie. And he's trying to kill me. He is very fast. He's very fast. He's very fast and I'm not up to the job. I'm not up to the job at all. I'm so screwed. I'm oh, so yeah. screwed. I'm not screwed. I'll just happily wait here for him to come around. And then blow him to pieces, but I do want to get that mat. That mat kit and then Oh yeah. I should really get a gaming keyboard with illuminated keys. That would really help. <coughs> Oh, I could just switch on the light, that also helps. But then it's hard to see what happens on the screen. Yeah, this, okay, I have to switch it off again. The lights, I mean. Some radioactive cabbage, or... Okay. Hmm. And I, I can kill him in one hit. Arrow. And now they are trying to kill me. Okay, fortunately, grenades seem to be very effective against those, those guys, whatever they are. And they are also very effective against myself. Not to myself. Stop killing yourself. 
No, I will not start. All the way. Over there. Or do I? No, I don't. Okay, where were we? Repelled sinners. Does it, do me, does it do me any good climbing on top of this? I don't think so. One thing that I do love... One thing that I do like about this game is the amount of tension. That is... The amount of detail. Um, <sighs> die already. Die. The amount of attention that was paid to small details. Like the fact... The fact that... When you... Uh, don't do something for... A minute or so... You start smoking a cigarette and... The cigarette is actually a 3D model... That stays there for a while. It is actually... Oh, yeah. Cigarette um, is actually a 3D model with proper smoke simulated. That is quite cool. <laughs> Let's just lure him out. Oh, yeah. yeah. <sighs> and then he doesn't come doesn't show up. And then I can't shit 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 oh, shit. Yeah. Huh. Couldn't find the U key for a moment. And that's not the way I wanted to go actually. Um Okay, that's not the way I want to go either. That's the way I want to go. Uh, because I like getting shot by rats. That I'm immune to radioactivity because they are mutated and giant and horrible and unfriendly. Worship right. Okay, I do agree with the fact, uh, with the proposal to exterminate all rats. I do support that. That emotion. Okay, note to myself. The radioactive blast radius of the radioactive grenade launcher is bigger then is suggested by the animation. Okay. And my timer will run up in exactly now. That means that I will save you at the exact same spot as we were last time and when we come back folks will hopefully make some progress so until next time folks until then